Dennis, in just the short period of time that you had here with this Nets team and this group, just what was just the biggest takeaway walking away just from this season um, that you guys said to each other yesterday after the game? I mean, to be grateful, first of all. Um, I think uh, it's a lot of people out there who want to, you know, be in the NBA and, um, you know, compete on the highest level. So be grateful. Um, at the end of the day, um, I appreciate everybody, you know, um, organization, um, locker room, my teammates, um, everybody involved. Um, I mean, it's been great, you know. Um, and, um, I mean, that was pretty much it. When you came in, this team was, you know, fighting for that play-in spot. Just how would you assess just how everything happened in those last couple of weeks of the season? I mean, first off, uh, we didn't accomplish our goals. Um, but at the end of the day, um, built, you know, uh, relationship, um, chemistry. And, um, you know, I think we built something um, over these last two months that we, you know, moving forward, um, accomplish our goals. So um, at the end of the day, we didn't accomplish our goals, but you can always learn from it and can get better. And um, everybody just, you know, uh, enjoy their summer, get with their families, work out, and uh, come back stronger. Dennis, for you just coming in so quickly and just acclimating yourself really well with this group, um, how do you see this team growing even more with you being here, hopefully for a full season, just getting that chemistry going and just seeing how, you know, guys responded well to you being a point guard, but also you responding well to knowing them a little bit more? Yeah, I think um, knowing people, knowing your teammates and uh, having the chemistry is, uh, I think, um, if not the most important thing. So um, I'm going to, you know, try to, get the team together uh, as much as possible um, in the summer. Um, I mean, for Summer League, if they want to come to Germany, uh, they can come, um, get everybody together and, um, you know, build something, like I said, uh, what we built over the last two months. Um, I think they took me in very easily. I said that before, and um, organization, you know, um, they trust, uh, you know, um, me as a point guard and, um, I love that, and um, we just want to keep, you know, um, building from here. And then just in your short time, what did you see maybe are ways that this team can improve in some aspects just from your short time here? Uh, for me, it's um, I always, uh, I always see um, what I can bring and what I can do better. Um, I think at the end of the day, um, Everybody coming more together. Um, I think it starts with me um, bringing everybody together. I mean, on the on the court, you know, it's a lot of things um, where we can get better at, um, and me as well. Um, I mean, that's that's pretty much it. What I have. Hey, Dennis. Nice watch, by the way. I like it. Thanks. What um, as a veteran guy here? What? What kind of traits would you like to see, whoever the next head coach is, what kind of traits would you like to see them have? Traits. Traits. What kind of uh, attributes, what kind of abilities, what kind of coach would you like to see it? Coach. Um, I like Kevin Ali. Uh, he did a great job. Um, but at, at the end of the day, it's, uh, it's not my decision. Um, I'm uh, not a GM, and uh, that's the reason why he get uh, Sean and all those guys get uh, the big bucks because uh, they got to make all the decisions. And um, for me, like I said, it's uh, all about having people who, you know, um, understands, I mean, the game of basketball, uh, of course, uh, understands the player and um, help us, you know, um, imp um how you say it, uh, get our goals um, at the end of the season. So um, get everybody on the same page. And um, yeah, I can't, I can't wait um, until, you know, we find out who's our next coaches. Just with your journey having taken you to, I think, five different teams in the last three seasons, 
And going into, you know, a contract year next year for you, you've talked a lot about the importance of family, being close to them. Is it a long-term goal for you to land in a place for a sustained period of time? Or have you kind of accepted that this is the nature of your profession? Yeah, I mean, the NBA is uh, it's a business at the end of the day. Um, my family at home... Um, is uh, the most important thing in my life. Um, so, and I'm playing in the best uh, league in the world. <clears throat> and I think uh, if you get traded, you know, your contract don't change. Um, I mean, your situation, the city might change, but um, your family is always with you. And um, my family was here, you know, supported me wherever I go. <clears throat> so, uh, I'm not really, you know, worried about that. Of course, Brooklyn, um, the last two months, um, been great. Um, like I said, organization-wise, um, how structured it is. Um, you guys as well, um, not bad. So, um, I mean, the city of Brooklyn, um, it was, it was great overall, and um, like I said, it's, it's always great to be in one place, but at the same, uh, at the same time, you got to be realistic as well, and um, it might change as well. Dennis, I'm assuming this offseason is going to be extremely busy just for you. Just what will it look like in these next couple of months, <clears throat> and especially with your goals and aspirations to play for Germany in the Olympics? Yeah, I mean... Yeah, national team is always is always uh, um, best thing uh, in the summer. Um, get together with my guys. You know, I've been playing with them for a long time, and I think uh, that you know, 30th of June, I think uh, we meeting um, as a team. Uh, I'm looking forward to that, and um, you know, compete on the. <coughs> highest tournament or the, the best um, level of tournament. Um, I never played in the Olympics and it's close to, you know, Germany. So um, the whole family is going to be there and uh, really excited. I mean, last summer it was in Japan. It uh, wasn't a lot of people uh, from my family and friends there. Um, I mean, it was. I mean, my kids and my wife, my two brothers, but I mean, now everybody can really um, get on the plane for two hours, my mom, and get to see me play. So I'm um, looking really uh, forward to it and um, compete, you know, on the, on the highest stage.